So this episode is all about bookmark positioning in City Engine and one really awesome artwork award. Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Tasha from the City Engine team here in Zurich and this is episode number eight. If you missed the other episodes, I'll make sure I link them at the end of this video. I'm also presenting another really cool awesome award this week, so make sure that you add the hashtags CityEngine or CityEngineArt to your posts on social media if you want to join in the fun there too. So let's talk about the new release. This week, I'd like to highlight the fact that you can now easily position the bookmarks in CityEngine. And this is a particularly interesting feature for our ArcGIS 360 VR app. So maybe you recognize this app and this face. And if you don't know that we're offering a mobile app, then make sure you check it out in the description box below. In the older versions of City Engine, the bookmarks were pretty clumsy to edit, but now it's possible to select a bookmark and manually move it using the transform tools. While you're doing this, you can see the bookmark as a preview in the inspector window, which makes it really easy to get the camera view that you actually want. So first of all, make sure that you've turned your bookmark gizmos on. In my example, you can see that the bookmark for entrance isn't placed in a very good spot. I can select the bookmark and then click on the move tool. Once I've done this, I can move the bookmark in the directions X, Y and Z. And the preview window helps me to easily position my bookmark in the correct place. By the way, it's also possible to select the scale and rotate tools too and apply their functions to a bookmark. So try it out for yourself. Today's awesome award goes to Kin Yao, who's making some really fantastic things with City Engine. Check out this destroyed city scene, which was created in City Engine and then rendered in Clarice. Kin Yao has a really impressive online portfolio of his renderings, so I'll link to his art station profile in the description box below. Once again, thanks for your time today and see you next week.